Okay, the day is here. It is finally UBS Belmont Day. Islanders fans have been waiting for this day for over a decade, and it's surreal that it's actually finally here. I am stoked. I'm so excited to see my fellow fans go to a home game again in an arena that's built for us and uh, got my necklaces on for my grandma. The uh, Got my Islanders necklace she gave me and my locket uh, that has pictures of her inside. So I have a piece of her with me, but I'm so excited, guys. Let's go. Yeah. 
through his remarkable leadership in the development of Smile Train and his support for the Charles B. Wong Community Health Centers in Manhattan and Queens and his support for the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children and his extensive and often anonymous philanthropy, Charles invested his heart and soul for the betterment of others. Tonight, we honor Charles for his loyalty to the Islanders community.
Challenger, number 40, Simeon Bolo. Number 15, Cal Quarterbug. Number 17, Matt Martin. And number 53, Casey Sissikas. I was so proud.
Calgary penalty for number 15, Brad Richardson. Two minutes for holding. Time of the penalty, 14-14. of the net by him. I'm really liking to see what uh, Panic's been doing out there. But honestly, Brock Nelson, right at the end there on the power play, scores the first ever goal at UBS Arena. was absolutely incredible, except for the ref that took his celly away because he doesn't have eyeballs. But going on from that, guys, it was so much fun to see that first goal. I'm hoping we can tie this game up in the second period, hoping for a little bit more energy. We saw it a little bit there at the end of the first period. I'm hoping that transfers to the second. So we'll see what happens. <laughs>
second period did not go well. What are you going to do when you have six players on COVID protocol and five players and one hurt? It's not much you can do. Notoriously though, the second periods haven't been our best, so I'm hoping for a better third. Let's see, I'm going to get more footage for you guys. But yeah, that kind of sucks. But hey, I'm enjoying the new arena. It's loud again. It gets loud, when, especially when you have those chants, especially the yes chant was absolutely spectacular, it was amazing. You can tell he put in a lot of detail into sound design for the arena, it's fantastic. So I'll see you for the third. Oh, mama, like that. Yes, yes, chance was awesome. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> but Kinesk, say hi, Claire. Hi. Say hi. hi. Shout out to the New York Islanders Booster Club over here. But yeah, incredible night. Great to experience. You can tell he put into sound design because that yes, yes, yes chant and the Islanders chants were so loud and proud. You can tell he put into sound design in this rink, and it it felt good. I didn't feel like I was losing anything from leaving Nassau Coliseum, which is exactly what you want. So, you know, despite the result, amazing to be even stepping foot in this arena tonight. And I hope you guys, you know, got to have a little taste of what this arena feels like. I'm going to get maybe, hopefully a little more shots on the way out, but this was awesome. Hi, Danny. <laughs> Farewell and adieu until tomorrow, UBS.